Oh my, that is quite a drop. Hey everybody, it's Dan at Squirrel Stampede and we are on episode 23. The abandoned mine shaft that we had found, stumbled upon when we were building our cow farm last week over there. Oh my goodness, that's way down there. Oh, this is going to be crazy. I am all ready to go though. I have got everything I need, I think, to go mining for a while. I've got a full set of all sorts of things. Well, not a full set. I actually put on a diamond tunic. No, not a tunic. A diamond chest armor and uh, mostly iron. I don't want to lose all my diamonds uh, because it's going to be a little tricky getting down there for sure. Oh boy. So here we go. We're going to jump into this hole and we are going to find out what's going on down there. There's water down there. I, my original plan was to make a waterfall bridge. Um, or whatever you call it, a waterfall fall. I could possibly just jump down there and survive that fall. Um, but I think I'm going to play it safe and do my waterfall idea. I'm going to do both, see what happens. So uh, I'm going to go over to this side, I think. Oh, I wonder what's down there. It's got to be just all sorts of evil. Here we go. So over here. And how is this possible? Didn't we plan on airing this in like um, 2035 or something like that? I can't remember. I think we must have uh, uh, pushed up the release date for this one. So here we go. I think this is where I'm going to go. Oh my goodness. Is that... What is that glowing in there? Anybody... Can anybody see? what is? What is that? It's not an Enderman, is it? There could be an Enderman down there. Okay, so here's the plan. I'm going to ride some water down, just like that Lego set we had built a couple days ago. Um, last week, two weeks ago, something like that. I'll link it there. Um, very similar, there was a little Lego waterfall slide. And we'll try that going down. I'm going to have to be careful of that lava being pushed into it. But I think we'll be okay. Oh, there's that purple thing again. What is that? I did not expect that. So here we go. Here we go. Oh, careful. Oh, this is too cool. Oh, this is perfect. I kind of tested this out on a different game recently, and I fell to my doom. So you got to be careful doing this sort of thing. Here we are in the abandoned mine. Oh, my goodness. There's bats flying around. Oh, this is so creepy cool. So the first thing we need to do is set up our base of operations. I'm going to put a little... Uh, dam here to block myself from going into this lava um, Let's see here Don't see anybody yet. No one's attacking me. Um, I think a great spot for a little House a little uh, underground cave house if you will we will build a squouse an underground squouse house We'll have to decorate this all squirrel like here in a second So let me dig this out and we will have our little uh, refuge to this great cave. Okay, oh my goodness, there's cobblestone everywhere. So this is what I brought. I brought a bunch of things. Uh, a purple bed. I thought maybe we'll just kind of hang out here for a while. So I wanted to bring a bed so that we could kind of stay the night. And let's see here, there's there's some iron right up in my ceiling. This is great. There's stuff everywhere. So let's put, I got a chest all ready to go. And we'll put that right there. Did I get a, I don't think I brought a crafting table. Whoops, I gotta make a crafting table. So we've got a crafting table to work with. Oh, I even brought a door. Where's my door? Now we'll be nice and safe down here. Poke my head out real quick. Nothing going on. There's a lot of water in here. Um, drop that there. Okay, now we've got a nice little safe zone for us. Oops, blew up the top of the door there. Um, what else was I going to put in here? Um, so now let's uh, put a few things in my chest. Let's move in. Let's kind of feel nice and safe here. Um, I don't need all these items. I've got some extra torches with me. I've got extra water. I'll keep the water. I'll leave the milk here just in case a witch gets me. I even planned for that. Uh, I've got my uh, enchanted leather tunic still. Um, these will be used as markers for wool. I'll leave the iron here, this iron ore I just found, an iron pickaxe back up. Um, wow, this iron pickaxe is already getting pretty well beat up. I didn't realize that. I'll leave the stone one here then. 
Uh, I don't think I need the fencing. The map is really risky taking with me, but I want to know kind of where I am underneath the squirrel house. And um, yeah, pretty good. I don't need all this um, big potatoes. I've brought a ton of big potatoes, ton of food. Um, cobblestone kind of there. Just kind of clear up some space here so that I don't know why I brought a minecart. There is there is some uh, um, rail, so we might be able to use it. So there we go, that's pretty good. I think I'll leave half my coal here. So, okay, we're good. We've, we've got ourselves moved in and now we can look around. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. This is where we fell in. Woo, ah, bats everywhere. Oh, we were gonna put a little quick decoration here um, above our door. We'll make it this purple cave squirrel head. This will be the purple cave squirrel head zone. Um, hmm. Let's see here. Jump on this. And I hear a zombie getting eaten. This cave is very much alive. Whoops. There we go. The purple squirrel cave hideout. It's like a superhero. The purple squirrel. All right, so now let's get my tools ready to go, and we will venture a little bit through here. Need to build a better um, dam first. Let's build a better dam first. Okay, so I probably shouldn't use wood right next to the lava. Let's get some cobblestone out, and I think we could do it this way. So here we go. Um, we will jump here. Oop. Actually, I might just put this out. There's no reason to have this lava right here. Of course, now I don't have any lights. Ah, it's dark in here. It's dark and scary. Oh, it's scary. Oh, my goodness. So now let's go back to this damn thing. Okay, so now let's go light up here and let's figure out this, this situation with the waterfalls. This is ridiculous. Okay, I think we can finally go exploring. I guess first we'll go in this level in this direction, right? It's nighttime outside, so I better be careful about not staying down here too long. I don't want phantoms coming after me. Um, but I'm down here, so I think I'm safe, right? So let's take a walk over here. All I hear is monsters. Mobs everywhere. All I hear is mobs. They are not happy with me in their territory. Ah, oh my goodness, oh, ah, okay. Back over here, that one really scared me. Okay, we've got this, we got diamond armor, so we're fine, we're fine, it's all good. It's all good, everybody stay calm. Stay calm, let's let's follow the skeleton into this dark cave, woo, yeah, that's right, that's what we need to do. That, that came out quickly, I that's the problem with these uh, giant caves, is things can kind of drop on you. Um, and that's exactly what happened. Definitely need to light up a little more. But, oh, we got something else coming at me. Oh, it's a zombie. Hello. Hello, zombie. Oh, my goodness. Man, I'm already getting pretty torn up here. Let's come back over here real quick and have a baked potato. We barely have gone in here. I feel like we're going to be in this, uh, this mine shaft for about 100 years. I really do. We've already been really well attacked oh there's another guy they're all coming in back into my safe house oh they're coming into my house ah get out of my house this is the purple squirrel's house you do not belong in here oh my goodness this cave is violent look at all these levels for mobs to drop on me and it is nighttime let's take a nap let's be safe let's take a quick nap and then we can go out whoo okay did i promise adventure today apparently um let's have another baked potato i'm still a little bit beat up from that last fight i think what was going on was things were dropping from the overworld because it was uh, nighttime up there at least we've got a skylight that makes me feel a little safer right now okay so let's kind of go back up a little more we'll venture a little more um can we kill bats i can't remember can we kill bats i don't think so um Oh man, it's a little tight in there. You gotta be like a shorty to get in there. I really kinda wanna go down this tunnel first and see what we got. 
let's kind of make the area around the purple squirrel house the safest. That way, you know, we kind of work our way around. Seems like the smartest idea, right? Maybe? I don't know. I keep double torching today. Oh, man. These abandoned mine shafts are always tricky. There's always something weird going on with them. And I think this is a dead end. Yeah, I think we're in a dead end. But it's one more safe spot now that I lit it up. One more safe spot. We'll have plenty of wood. I brought a lot of wood with me and um, I don't think we'll need it. And we'll have plenty of spider webs too. All right, so I'm gonna make a little stair step, I think, up to this wood level here. I think that's going to be smartest. The smartest, man, <laughs> zombies are gargling everywhere. Um, this will be the smartest way to get up here and see what we can find. Oh. oh, oh no. Oh, that's not good. Oh no, that's not good. You don't, oh, okay. No, 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 stop. Oh my gosh. Okay, don't blow up, don't blow up. Now we're in trouble. I don't have much room. Oh. Wow, that was lucky. We were like being pushed back into the back of this mine. Oh, that was, that was scary. That was, that was dangerous. Everything about this place is danger. This is total danger zone right now because we haven't really lit it up or anything. Oh, there's that purple thing again. Ah, ah, oh. We're gonna hopefully see what is making that purple thing. How are we doing for health? Mm, not that great, actually. I'm already getting pretty well beat up. E. Ooh, okay. Have a baked potato. I really want to see what that purple thing is back there. It's got to be an enderman up to its sinister deeds. Um, or just hanging out in the cave like we are. Um, this has been slow moving. Getting up here. Slow moving. Okay, I got it. Oh, my controller. Okay, here we go. Gotta get these torches going. Alright, I see something sparkling over there. I see railway. We've got railway. I'd love to have some extra railway to go into No Squirrel. What is that? What is that stuff? Is that an Enderman doing that? Oh my. Ah! A creeper! Run for it! Run for it! Oh, and there's a burning zombie over here back into this cave. Oh dear. We got time, we got time. Oh, he's coming right after me again. This is not good. I can't pull my sword out. I can't get the sword out in time. I'll fall into that hole. Okay, no, no. Ah, just like his brother died. In a second, this is creeper kill zone. Let's um make a sign here. Um, we'll put a sign right here. I think it's necessary to put creeper kill zone. Creeper kill zone. Zybe? What's what's Zybe? I'm just Zybin. Creeper kill zone. Now we know this is where creepers go to die. Okay, so back we go. Back we go. I can't believe how dangerous this cave is. This is nuts. Nuts, I tell ya. Um kind of want to get some light up on this thing. I brought some ladders with me. Let's make a ladder up here. Here's a perfect spot for a ladder. <laughs> I hear zombies in here. Oh, there's another one. Oh, man. Oh, and my controller is so slow. Okay. You want to go, dude? All right. Whew. Man, everything is just jumping out at me. We're going to build right over this iron ore. I'm going to build a little ladder up to this level. I feel like I need to just get torches and things everywhere. I, of course, switched my torches with a ladder. That was dumb. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Oh, this is so intense today. So intense. I could barely talk. Oh, gosh. I just ran into this cave not really thinking where I was going, but I feel like things keep surprising me. Okay, so that's pretty good. That was a good, good safety run. And so here's our main room again. Another light over here. Okay. Oh, there's something going on. Do you think... Oh, there's that... Sp it's the Enderman. I see him. Do you see the Enderman? Let's not look directly at him. But let's kind of admire... Oh, oh, oh. He kind of looked at me. Oh, there must be a spawner in here somewhere. We must be really close to a spawner, too. Um, let's kind of rebuild this bridge. And look around over here. Add a few more... Oh, be careful. Be careful. Okay, here's another cave. 
Oh my goodness. Oh, oh, okay, there's someone behind me. There's someone behind me. Get the sword ready. Get the sword ready. Oh, this is not what I wanted. I did not expect it to be this dangerous today. Okay. Here we go. A little more exploration of the abandoned mine. Look at all this railway. I need to start um, collecting this stuff. What's what's the best way to pick up railway? Pickaxe. Yeah, I'd love to have a railway go to No Squirrel, or not No Squirrel, um, to the Flying Squirrel. That would be great. Um, so we got that lit up. It's getting a little quieter as I say that. Okay. No! Oh man, get in the water, get in the water. Who got me? Who did that? Ah, you did that. Gotta get my sword. Ah, oh, he didn't make it. Woo! What an adventure it is in here. It's absolutely crazy. Let's go up this way now. That's a good way. Yeah, I'm just trying to go around all different directions and just kind of fortify this area so it is not so completely nuts as it is right now. So we're going to build another little ladder right here. And I hope I brought enough pieces. I think I brought... I didn't think I need this much ladder. Okay, um, let me just do that. Okay. Um, get some torches in here. Look at this cave. Look over there. Do you see the Enderman? He's looking right at me. He's like, what are you doing, dude? And I'm like, I'm not supposed to look in your face because that's just going to anger you. That's that little cave I just wandered through a second ago. It kind of wraps back here. Let's break this out so that if I need to take a quick run over there, I can. Um, I can't believe how cool this abandoned mine shaft is. Sometimes, well, usually, oh, oh, a skeleton. Um, you'll find emeralds. Oh, I need to eat something, too. You'll find emeralds in these abandoned mines, so that would be great if we found an emerald. Okay. I bet everyone was like, eat something, Dan. Fill your hearts up. Fill your hearts up. Not really paying attention because I'm so excited. I'm looking around the corner. Look how I'm, like, looking around the corner. Um, is that a bat on the ceiling? What is that? Oh, it's, a, it's an arrow. Okay, so oop, I see where we need to kind of go. We need to kind of go... Oh my goodness, it's going to wrap around this way? Oh my goodness, just get more and more torches in here. Oh, who put that torch in there? I sure didn't. Oh wow. And then let's stop up this. Stop that up. Going to need more light. Oh, that's what I was going to do. I brought a lot of wool. So I like to use wool as markers sometimes when you're in these caves just to kind of go, oh, that's where I am. And I don't know, that Enderman's getting closer again, isn't he? A little worried about this. Uh, I saw him peeking over there. I don't want to look back because he's looking right at me. This is a huge... Oh, there's a zombie in iron, or, uh, leather armor back there. He's Oh, and there's a lot of webbing. Oh, I thought... Oh, wait, wait. Could be a spawner back there, but I, eh, I don't think so. Let's check over here. Oh, it's... I'm getting a little confused. Oh, I think I saw a creeper back there. Let's kind of retreat a little bit, because I've got a skeleton on me. This place is just nuts. Absolutely nuts. Ah. Oh my goodness. Okay, I need to go up this way, too. There's like a hundred different ways I can go. I, I just don't know where to go. I, I just want to light things up and fortify um, as best as I can so less things sneak up on me. Um, and then we can go mining, I suppose. Um, I really... Uh, what is going on in here? This place is just crazy. Look at this huge room in here. Try not to burn my head in the lava. Look at that! This this whole crack in the earth goes on. Kind of like a combination between the giant crack in the earth and a abandoned mine is what we've got going here. And it's really neat. I, I don't think I've seen one this, um, this variety. There's so much variety. Oh, he's going through the... Man, look at those nice shoes you have. I like those shoes you got. How about I help you out? I'll put this here, and then you... Give me those shoes. Yeah, come here. Come here. Oh, it hurts. How strong do you think he is with all those shoes? Oh, pretty strong. Oh, did I get the shoes? He gave me the shoes. Oh, but then someone attacked me from over here. Ah, ah, and now I'm hurt. Oh, hang in there, hang in there. Uh, why am I stuck? 
I'm stuck on something. Oh my goodness. Oh, that was close. That was terrifically close. Let's kind of get back into a more safe spot. I don't know where what is safe in here. Um, let's let's take these shoes back to the purple squirrel house. Oh, there's a guy down there. Um, should have brought a bow with me. Uh, what's your name? Your name is KV KV10. Well, KV KV10. This is what I got for you, KV KV10. Oh, oh boy. <sighs> All right, let's go back into the purple house for a minute and take stock of what we have. Um, oh my gosh, this cave is nuts. I, yi, yi, yi. I don't even know what to say. Um, let's eat um, a potato real quick and put my shoes. So, so far, all I've found is a pair of enchanted leather boots and some bones and some flesh. Oh my goodness. Wow. I cannot believe how scary this cave is. All right, let's go out one more time. Let's try to get my hearts up as much as they can here. Um, let those grow back. And I'd like to sneak around just a little more. There's that enderman, he's just hanging out, like going, why are you messing up my cave, he's saying. And I'm like, why are you messing up my cave? And he's like, why are you messing up my cave? And I'm like, why are you messing up my cave? And he's like, I'm messing up your cave. And I'm like, no, this is my cave. Now I'm really confused. Okay, so I have two choices, up here a little more or back here. I kind of want to go back here um, where we got our really cool shoes and go from there oh my goodness i kind of feel like we're near there's got to be a spawner somewhere in this cave because there's so much so much going on what's the best way to get rid of webbing is it swords web that's what i got stuck in earlier that's right it was webbing i was i was frozen and i was trying to figure out what i did and it was that web there's so many things to take stock of in here just kind of clearing out some stone and this oh my goodness these guys are so loud okay here we go kind of sneak over here this is a huge abandoned mine we're definitely gonna have to go into a part two on this thing okay oh there's like a, another spot okay let's let's clear out this lava let's be smart and clear out lava. Or at least kind of put a barrier for now. I'm gonna leave it just so that I know. Sometimes it helps to leave lava because you can kind of use it as a marker. Okay, feeling safer. Let's get ourselves a little step up now. Oh my. So now we're back on another level here. I think this is a dead end. Oh no. It goes back a little bit more. Nope, a dead end. Yeah. That often happens. You kind of can recognize certain things in abandoned mines when you see these like little stairways down. They often kind of just get blocked off. And then let's build a little wood bridge over. This should bring me back closer to the purple squirrel I think right am I going in circles I feel like I'm going back that way here's some more rail to pick up I haven't been picking up the rail as best as I can but okay yeah so here's finally a way wait where are... okay there yeah we're right above the purple squirrels house the purple squirrel house and the enderman is still busy working over there oh funny how he just keeps working And this is a great spot um, to kind of look around. Let's get some more wood ready. I should have had wood ready, a lot more wood for bridges. Because I kind of want to complete this little thing here. Oh, it's so close. And I don't have the best hunching ability. There we go. I don't think if I fall off this I'll die. I think I'm okay for height. But 
this is an, a really cool area to put some safe things. Is it nighttime? It is nighttime, so this is really stupid again because things can come drop on me at any minute. But it's really cool to kind of get this perimeter going in this cave. So just a little more. I'll sneak around. Oh, am I out of torches? I am out of torches. What do you know? I've been using a lot of torches. Let's kind of find a safe spot real quick. Nothing going on here, I don't think. Um, make a few more torches. Where's torches? Okay, here we go. Kind of sneak back over here. Oh, and then I can sneak into that corner. Good. More light. Enderman is ending. Oh, water dripping. Water dripping over here. Is it safe to go in here? No, oh, it's pretty dark in here. Water dripping. It's really dark. I feel like it's getting safer though. This looks like it just goes into a cave. So kind of pull back here. I kind of just want to stay in the uh oh. Oh no! What do you? Oh what? Oh look at!